81 years ago, President Franklin Roosevelt signed Executive Order 9066. That executive order led to the forced removal and eventual incarceration of more than 120,000 Japanese Americans. Right here in Idaho, nearly 14,000 people were incarcerated between 1942 and 1945 at the Minidoka War Relocation Center, a World War II American concentration camp about 18 miles northeast of Twin Falls. Earlier today, a group of local organizations, including Friends of Minidoka, held a remembrance event at the Idaho State Museum. Today's theme, the power of words. We wanted to make sure that we had an event today that alongside the Boise public was putting truth to the words of experiences. Concentration camp, an incarceration, an unjust incarceration of people. About 100 people showed up to the event, including Karen Hirai Olin, who was born in the Minidoka concentration camp. She hopes people continue to learn from the unjust incar incarcerations so that something like it never happens again. More than anything, my message would be, let's, don't go there. It doesn't benefit anybody. And basically, erases the dignity and the value of a culture and of people as individuals. Hirai Olin says many people don't know about the Minidoka War Relocation Center and that events like today's help raise awareness about something that was in our backyards less than 100 years ago.